my name is Kayla. Uh, this is a Norwex EnviroCloth versus bleach and paper towel protein swab demonstration. Um, so I'm going to rub a uh, raw egg um, on each side. So over here we've got bleach, obviously. Over here we've got the EnviroCloth. Um, and here I have the tester swab I'm going to be using. This is the package that I got it in. You can see it has nothing to do with Norwex. This is a third party protein tester swab. Um, these are used in restaurants and things like that to test the cleanliness um, of the restaurant. Protein particles are smaller than um, almost any bacteria or germs. So we use the protein to demonstrate what exactly the Norwex cloths can pick up. All right, so let's give it a try here. Um, this paper towel, you can see I've wet it with some water and put a, put some bleach water on there. It's pretty damp. Um, and this I've just dampened with water. So I'm going to take some of this egg here. Probably doesn't matter what part of the egg I get it on, but use some yellow. Just to make it fun, I'm going to rub it all over here, both sides. Nice. This kind of freaks me out. That's okay. I bake a lot, so I get stuff all over the counters. I'm going to rinse my hand off with a uh, guest appearance of the Norwex uh, netted dishcloth. The virus thing? Is that a spirit sponge? I don't care. Uh, my kitchen cloth. <laughs> Anyways. And the veggie scrub cloth. Anyhow, okay, so back to the demonstration. <sighs> Let's see how it goes. I'm going to pick up the side first. I made sure that bleach got on all parts of the cloth here. Or all parts of the paper towel. I don't want any protein residue. Um, normally I would do this with raw chicken, but I just finished cooking all my raw chicken. So protein in anything is going to give us a good idea um, at all. So let's get all that bleach on the surface. Really clean that up there. Okay. So there's that. I'm going to put this in the trash can. And so we've got the Enviro cloth. Let's move that little guy out of the way. So beyond the fact that this is actually going to pick up the egg way faster, it's also going to take up all of the proteins and any bacteria that would be left on the counter uh, with just water. So most people who use Norwex will probably agree that it's better than most cleaners especially you know chemical cleaners and natural cleaners and almost anything um we prefer it over any other product but the purpose of norwex is not necessarily to be better but to use just water um in place of chemicals to do the same job or better okay so we've cleaned up both sides here um we've got our protein tester swab so Let's get that out one second here. All right, so as you can see, these are the colors that we're gonna be looking for, okay? Uh, green means clean, and the purple and gray means that it's not an acceptable amount of protein, that there is still a risk. Um, obviously, gray is regular, you know, moderate risk. The Purple in the middle there means you got a pretty good, you know, regular high risk. And the dark purple is very, very high risk um, of having, of detecting protein, um, which also means that there's other stuff on your counter too. Okay, so I'm going to take this part. I'm going to test it um, on the Enviro cloth area that I cleaned first. As you can see, it should be really picking up anything there. Okay, so I'm going to be putting that back in. Let's get that on there nice and good. Is it on there? Okay. Let's see. 
Now we're going to snap this, and that liquid is going to go down to the test swab and tell us how much protein or bacteria there was detected. Sorry, it's not focusing. Okay. So I'm just going to break this down like a glow stick. And the liquid is going to transfer to the bottom. You can see um, it's green, very obviously so. And it didn't take much time to figure that out. <laughs> didn't take the swab much time at all. Bright green, not even close to gray. Um, so what I'm going to do instead of using another test swab, because these actually cost like $3 each or something like that, I'm going to use the same little white swab and swab this area and then shake it in the liquid to see if the color changes or stays the same. So one second here. All right, I've got the swab. Now, like I said before, the purpose of Norwex is not necessarily to be better than everything else, but to do the same job with just water because the chemicals in your house uh, can be very, very toxic. Um, but I'll give some details on that later. So here's the swab. You can even see the green on it. <laughs> I'm going to test this bleach area just to see if we get a different color um, or if the chemicals did pretty much the same thing and water did the same job that the chemicals did. I want to really get that swab in there just like I did with the environmental cloth so just so we can know because who wants to use chemicals and it not actually be working. Um, okay so I'm going to put this back in the liquid here and shake it up. Now, I really used to use bleach all the time, so this will be interesting to see what the outcome is. Okay, I don't know if you can tell, but the green is starting to turn gray. It's starting to turn a darker color, and the test swab tip is actually starting to turn a little bit purple. Um, let me keep shaking so you can actually see on camera what it looks like. So all I did was put water on the mirror cloth and bleach on the paper towel. Just a regular paper towel, some bleach water. Um, this is the bleach I used. Found it in the cupboard. Right. You can kind of see it starting to turn gray. Um, and that's, that's the, uh, color that a lot of consultants get whenever they swab this is a gray color. Oh, you can really start to see it now. Yeah. So it's starting to turn gray, which means there is not an acceptable amount of protein or bacteria on this counter. It is unacceptable. And if it were going for a test, it would not pass the test. Um, it would fail the test of cleanliness wherever it was being tested by restaurants, schools, um, things like that. There we go. Now you can see it. That is solid gray, ladies and gentlemen. And if you want to see what it looks like if I dipped it purely in the egg, um, this is what it would look like. This is one dipped in pure protein, um, so it would turn very dark purple. So we've got, for the bleach, which I'm actually kind of surprised, it's gray and not acceptable, but you could remember that uh, for the Norwex cloth, it was bright green. And there was no protein on it, and you're using just water. So thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.